Hey everybody, Dan from On One here. I want to give you another sneak peek on some new technology that we're working on for the future. Now most of you are probably familiar with No Noise, our brand new AI-based noise reduction application. It was released in the spring as a standalone application, but it's now coming as a built-in piece of the next version of Photo Raw. And the best part is, it's tightly integrated with Photo Raw. It's just like any other non-destructive Raw setting. So here's a photo that I opened up. This happens to be a raw photo. Let me turn off the preview. There's the original photo, kind of flat and yucky out of the camera. So I'd gone in, done some basic raw adjustments to it, and brought up the vibrance a little bit, and then I went into effects and I added a color adjustment filter just to kind of shift some of those yellow greens in the tail feathers to really be a much more vivid green. Now the problem is when I zoom in on this photo and I take a look, it's pretty noisy. Let me zoom in even closer here. So this is at 200%. This photo was shot at 5,600 ISO and it makes it pretty noisy. Well, now that I have no noise built in, I simply go down to the details pane and I turn on no noise. There you go. You can see the original on the left, very noisy and the results with no noise applied on the right as I divide that back and forth. I can make whatever adjustments I need in here. I'm just gonna turn the split screen preview off to make this a little easier to make my adjustments. The luminance slider controls how much noise reduction I'm gonna have. I'm gonna use that pretty high all the way at the top. The enhanced detail slider controls how much detail enhancement I'm gonna have. I just adjust this to taste. For me, I like it at about 40 on this photo. And the color slider adjusts the amount of color noise reduction. And it's pretty rare I use that anywhere except for the top. And if I want to, I can also add additional sharpening to it as well. We start off with a base of about 20. I kind of like about where it was. When I'm happy with my noise reduction results, I just hit apply. So you can see how I'm able to use no noise, just like any other non-destructive setting. And I can use it at any time in my workflow process. Even though I've already done raw processing, even if I've used other tools, if I've created masks or if I've done retouching, I can still go back and adjust my no noise noise reduction settings at any time. I can even copy and paste those settings or create presets with them. Let me show you. I'm just going to jump back to browse. You can see in this album, there's the photo I just worked on. You notice it has the no noise icon on it. I can simply copy and paste or sync the settings from this to other similar photos. So I'm just going to select both photos, click on the sync button, and just make sure that my options are turned on for no noise. And of course, the adjustments I did in develop and effects. And you'll see how the adjacent photo now carries the exact same non-destructive settings, including no noise. There you go. That's how no noise is integrated into the next version of On One Photo Raw. Thanks for watching.